Hi, I'm Lulua Khazoum, and I want to share with you why I chose not to take conventional medical advice and get surgery for removing the uh, nodules on my thyroid, which were indicated to be cancerous. The reason is that I think, number one, the body has the intelligence and ability to heal itself. And we just have to create the right environment in order for it to do that. Second is that I figure that if the cancer is there, something caused it. And if I just take it out surgically, I'm not getting to the root of what caused it. And it could potentially, God forbid, grow back again. I think it's better for me to put in the effort of exploring every aspect of my life and figuring out what brings me into balance and harmony and excellent health so that then I have that health for the rest of my life. I also find that in pursuing my healing, I'm having this incredible adventure. I am learning so much about myself, about my body, about nutrition, about the healing process. I am meeting incredible people. I am making some wonderful friends that I wouldn't have met if I wasn't on this journey. And most importantly is cancer really pushes you to figure out how are you living your life and, and how do you need to be living your life and who are you? I'm now living in the middle of the forest in a studio apartment. I'm a city girl. I was in a three bedroom, two story house in the middle of the city. This is some really radical changes that I'm making. I'm traveling the world. I'm living out of a suitcase and I've just started another band. It's been really clear to me that music, water, nature, and dance are extremely important for me to incorporate into my everyday life. So is journaling. Um, so as I continue on this journey, I discover more and more things about myself. I push harder and harder and go deeper and deeper inside to find out what do I really need to transform myself on every level and become healthy on every level. And I find that really exciting. And yes, some of the times I'm terrified because my life is on the line. I'm not being you know, naive about this. I'm not going in with my eyes closed. But it's a very individual choice how we want to respond to cancer or any health issue. And my experience was that when I had debilitating chronic pain, I went from bad to worse in the healthcare system. I bounced around from doctor to doctor, body worker to body worker. I was bedridden, housebound, wheelchair bound. And it was when I put my health in my own hands and I developed a dance method, that's when I healed myself. And I went from being bedridden to being able to bike 30 miles at a shot without any pain. So I believe that we can find our own portal to wellness and that um, one option is to give ourselves the time to be able to explore that. Now, everybody's cancer is different. I had the gift of a slow growing cancer and so I had time to play with. Some people may not have that time and again, we can't judge each other's choices. For some people, surgery might be the right option, chemotherapy might be the right option, but for some people, it may be the wrong option and we really need to allow ourselves to follow our intuition and listen to our heart and respond to our health condition in whatever way is right for us.